Hey, welcome back. This is the Spirit Manga 187. And as I promised, I will show you a match with the Zaladar deck. I don't know if I'm gonna win this. I don't play Zaladar much because I really don't like the elemental decks. But yeah, I'm open to any deck, so uh, let's just give it a try. I've played it only a few times before. It's it's a good deck, so let's just start. We love where we left off. 276 rating so let's just give it a try and we'll see what happens of course we're going for the win because Saladar is good and our opponent is a priest okay let's just say be a little bit polite to Baza 1 2 3 4 and let's see what we can do against this priest So my opening hand is not too bad, not too good. I don't have a decent turn to drop. Um, let me see. I'm going to sacrifice one of these. Yes, and and turn. Zana the mist. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty. Curious, what is he going to play? If you're going to play uh, with lots of allies, you see lots of priests with lots of allies or with minimum number of allies. So I don't know what to expect here. But I think he's going for the turn to drop. Yeah, champion or the pioneer, of course. Uh, what are you going to throw away? Mm, this is hard. Just take away him. I'm gonna cast this or mm, I'm gonna sacrifice it next turn. I think I'm gonna throw it away. It's a pretty good card, but I don't want it in, in the opening hand, so especially not against the priest. I don't see him do a lot of damage very quick. Unless I do nothing against his allies of course. So, no turn 3 drop for him, as I expected. Here he gains one, one extra attack and the defense. Let's just see what he's up to. It's not a really big problem. The champion of Iron. Uh, he's probably gonna play a weapon right now. The uh, draw card, the wizard staff, isn't called. No, it's gonna heal his champion. Okay, nice. So next turn, I think I'm gonna play a shadow font. Yep, I'm gonna play a shadow font. And I'm gonna sacrifice one shadow font, cast another. We're going to use the ability on the champion and on this armor. And then um, we're gonna kill the champion. So he's probably not gonna play a tidal wave <laughs> only for this creature. So let's see what he plays now. Uh, if it's gonna be a big creature or an armor or a weapon, I don't know. It's priest decks. What do they play in turn five? I think he's going to play an armor. Or the weapon, uh, the dealer staff. No, it's a Raven Wild Heart, of course, or the, the big worm. I forgot the name. Um, what are we going to sacrifice here? We're going to throw away the Morbid Acolyte. And we're casting a Mind Control on this Raven. Such a good card, Mind Control. Always play it four times. <laughs> See, most of the cards I play three times, but cards like Mind Control, that's a must card. Always four times. So what do we have left? We have Leyland Nexus, destroy his weapons or armor. And we can do damage to his creatures with his good old Fury and Terror, and let's sacrifice the land for some additional card run. 
if he draws out something big. Ah, uh, wizard staff. Nice card draw. A must play card for the priest. What do we have here? We can sacrifice nothing. And we have nothing here. So we're just gonna chop him for two. And I think I'm going to cast the sacrifice for that. And hope I get a, a creature I can cast. But I did not draw any creatures or allies. So let's grab. And then turn. Well, let's see what he will do now. Will he draw a big creature out? The 3 8 creature that has Protector? I forget, I'm so bad in names. I always forget the names of the allies but, and all the other cards. But nope, another Raven Wildheart. And we're gonna go with another Mind Control on that card. So, that's not nothing to worry. I'm gonna throw away this. And we will just cast another Mind Control. Take him down to 13. Boom, boom, boom. Well, we can't use this ability, so we're gonna enter. He's drawing a lot of cards, that sucks, but he has to save some of his shadow energy if he wants to stay alive, so. So the champion is no problem, we're gonna fry it with our ability. Book of Curses, no problem. Nothing we can't handle. Gonna throw away any matter. And use the ability. Let them both suffer 3 damage. And we're going to play Shadow Knight. And we're going to enter him. Let's see what he's going to do against the Shadow Knight. Is he going for a tidal wave or is he going to return into my hand? Tidal wave it is. Only two resources left. And he keeps drawing cards instead of healing. So, that's interesting. Uh, let's just draw away the Fury and Terror. And take back the Shadow Knight. And we're going to cast another Death Collector. So, we will probably cast another Tidal Wave. But yeah, we have to draw it out anyway, so that doesn't matter. But don't go over excited, so don't drop all of your creatures if you're playing against a priest or a mage, because they got mass destruction. So, always keep an hand some creatures, but I really had to play two now, to lure out the tidal wave. But that's not a problem at all. He's playing an all Nice, nice, nice. Um yeah, what are we going to drop here? Five eight four three uh, play this one, we got three resources left. So are we gonna activate the ability or are we taking down the staff? I hate that staff. It's really gotta go. It has to go. But let's just Give it for now. Or? Mm, let's just skip it for now. And I'll just play this one. And another morbid acolyte. We're going to activate the ability to do three damage to both of them. And I'm dropping him down to seven. <laughs> yeah, it was a long turn. But yeah, you have to make the good choices, right? Because I don't play a lot of Saladar decks, so I have to think about what I have to sacrifice and how I have to play this. See, there's the King's Pride. And he's going to take down the Shadow Knight. He has no problem. He's going to smash down that King's Pride. The Leyline Nexus. So, no problem. 
shooting him down to five or taking down his Alden. Mm, we'll see. I think we're gonna. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. This is really nice. Uh, going to do this. Cast this on the King Sprite. Bam. Then. Oh, I thought I had mana left for the. Of course not. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, if I hit him, his weapon is gone. He's down to six. Okay, there's all of them, all of them gone, but do I need the all of gone? No, I don't need it to go on. Smash. Down with your weapon. Use this ability. What to throw away? Let's throw away the death match. Foster, please, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry about that. But uh, yeah, as I told you, I don't play elemental heroes that much so I have to make good choices and I think I did because he's a very low life I've got some good cards in my hand so he's taking me down to 23 no problem let's just throw away the line and use the mind control to take him down to 3 Play the shadow found with my ability to take him down. Done. That's how we do it, and that's how he died. So it was pretty fun to play this elder deck. But I have to think a lot about the choices I have to make and which card I have to sacrifice. Uh, maybe I'll show some more matches with Zelda. Uh, just let me hear what you want to see, and uh, we'll make some new bits. Okay, that's it for today. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and uh, yeah, if you have any questions, let me hear. That's all. Cheers.